नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स लेट्स स्टार्ट आवर टू डेज टेन इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन ऑफ ऑक्जिलरी मशीन दिज क्वेश्चन आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर वेरियस एग्जाम्स कंडक्टेड बाई डिफरेंट कंपनीज आवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज सेंट्रीफ्यूगल पम्प्स एंड डिसप्लेसमेंट पम्प्स डिफर इन सेवरल कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स रिगार्डिंग ए सेंट्रीफ्यूगल पम्प इज करेक्ट एंड द ऑप्शन आर द इनलेट इज इन द आउटर डायमीटर ऑफ द इम्पेलर एंड द प्रेशर ऑफ डिस्चार्ज इज इन द सेंटर ऑफ द इम्पेलर A centrifugal pump is always fitted in a vertical position. It is important that the rotation direction is correct to avoid dry running. A centrifugal pump is designed to take a suction from 30 to 35 meters height, suction height. And the correct option for this question is it is important that the rotation direction is correct to avoid dry running. Our next question is You have emptied the bilge wheel in the engine room using the bilge pump. After stopping, why is it important that all valves are closed? And the options are to avoid the pump house to be emptied for fluid for safety reasons otherwise sea water could enter the engine room. To keep the pump house empty for fluid to ensure an easier start of the pump to avoid corrosion inside the pump. and the correct option for this question is for safety reasons otherwise sea water could enter the engine room our next question is what type of pump of the below mentioned would be most suited for serving as a high pressure boiler water feed pump and the options are axial flow counter screw rotary base multi stage centrifugal and the correct option for this question is multi stage centrifugal pump our next question is which type of rotary pumps are suited for use as lubrication and oil piston cooling services on diesel engines and the options are vane screw any of the mentioned alternatives gear and the correct option for this question is any of the mentioned alternatives our next question is the type of pump used for delivering the oily water mixture to an oily water separator governs considerably the degree of contamination in the effluent what type of pump would be best suited not to churn the supply and produce small oil droplets and the options are centrifugal axial flow mixed flow is that partial axial part axial part centrifugal screw and the correct option for this question is screw pump our next question is from where should a boiler water sample be taken for testing and the options are from the steam space from the feed system from the water space any place where possible and the correct option for this question is from the water space our next question is what is the primary function of a non return valve fitted in the suction line of a pump and the options are to prevent the suction line from draining and keeping the pump primed to keep one foot of liquid in the suction line to regulate the flow of fluid through the pump to keep the pump from losing its balance and the correct option for this question is to prevent the suction line from draining and keeping the pump primed our next question is If a shaft of a centrifugal pump shows excessive wear by way of the stuffing box is this caused by and the options are excessive heating caused by over tightening of the gland packing wrong direction of rotation incorrect material used in construction of the shaft discharge pressure of the pump too high and the correct option for this question is excessive heating caused by over tightening of the gland packing our next question is low temperature corrosion can occur in both oil fired and exhaust or waste heat recovery boilers considering a fuel with same sulfur content the air fuel number lambda in a combustion process also indicates a relation to what temperature sulfuric acid condensates what is the correct relation between air fuel ratio and low temperature corrosion and the options are high air fuel ratio raises the condensation temperature and thereby reducing the safe limits between normal operation and condensation temperature high 
air fuel ratio lowers the boiler temperature causing the sulfur acid to condensate high air fuel ratio does not contribute significant to change of condensation temperature high air fuel ratio rises the air speed and thereby lowers the pressure and temperature so sulfuric acid condensates and the correct option for this question is high air fuel ratio rises the condensation temperature and thereby reducing the safe limits between normal operation and condensation temperature our last question is while their respective characteristics differ in detail which of the following main operating features do all positive displacement pumps have in common if they are working under non cavitating condition and the options are the pump will develop a discharge pressure equal to the resistance to be overcome irrespective of speeds they are self priming flow is almost directly proportional to speed all of the mentioned alternatives and the correct option for this question is all of the mentioned alternatives is that all the other three alternatives are correct now let's just summarize what we have studied in this video centrifugal pumps and displacement pumps differ in several characteristics which of the following statements regarding a centrifugal pump is correct it is important that the rotation direction is correct to avoid dry running you have emptied the bilge well in uh, in the engine room using the bilge pump after stopping why is it important that all valves are closed for safety reasons otherwise sea water could enter the engine room what type of pump of the blow mentioned would be more suited for serving as a high pressure boiler water fed pump multi stage centrifugal pump which type of rotary pumps are used are suited for use as lubrication and oil piston cooling services on diesel engines any type any of the mentioned alternatives is that vein pump it can be a vein pump a screw pump gear pump the type of pump used for delivering the oily water mixture to an oily water separator governs considerably the degree of contamination in the effluent what type of pump would be best suited not to churn the supply and produce small oil droplets screw pump from where should a boiler water sample be taken be taken for testing from the water space what is the primary function of a non return valve fitted in the suction line of the pump to prevent the suction line from draining and keep the pump primed if a shaft of a centrifugal pump shows excessive wear by way of the stuffing box is this caused by uh, excessive heating caused by over heat tightening of the gland packing low temperature corrosion can occur in both oil fired and exhaust or waste heat recovery boilers considering a fuel with same sulfur content the air fuel number lambda in a combustion process also indicates a relation to what temperature sulfuric acid condensates what is the correct relation between air fuel ratio and low temperature corrosion high air fuel ratio raises the condensation temperature and thereby reducing the safe limits between normal operation and condensation temperature while their respective characteristics differ in detail which of the following main operating features do all positive displacement pumps have in common if they are working under non cavitating cavitating conditions in this all the men, uh, mentioned alternatives are correct is that the pump will develop a discharge pressure equal to the resistance to be overcome irrespective of speed they are self priming flow is almost directly proportional to speed thank you for watching the video like and subscribe for more such videos